Hey, what's up? Welcome to Being Classy. My name is Peter. In this video, I want to show you just how to do a second line indent or a hanging indent in Microsoft Word. Now I'm using Microsoft 365 version of Word on a MacBook. If you have an older version of Word or a different operating system or the online version of Word, the buttons and toolbars might look a little bit different, but the basic steps are the same. Let's jump in. This is a quick little one page paper I have and all of the text is left justified. It's all lined up on the left margin. Now what I want to do is keep this top line on the left margin and indent everything following in this paragraph over half an inch. There's two different ways to do it. The easiest one is to use this at the top, this ruler to change your indentations. If you don't see this ruler, you can click on view at the top and add your ruler. Now that your ruler is on, if you highlight the text that you want to second line indent or hanging indent, and go up here, what you want to do is just grab the bottom arrow, not the top. So if you grab just the bottom arrow and drag it over, you'll see that the bottom arrow, everything that hangs below the first line is now indented half an inch. So that's one easy way to change your paper or document to have a hanging or a second line indent. The other way that you can do this, again, if you highlight the section of text that you want to be a second line or hanging indent, and you go to format, paragraph again on a different operating system that format button would be in a slightly different location but it's the same process and you go to the middle of this window that pops up and you see a section on indentation now all my indentation is set to zero but what i want to do is go to the special indentation section click on it and change it to a hanging indent now it's going to go to the standard hanging indent by half an inch go down to the bottom of the window click ok and the same thing has happened. You'll notice in the ruler up here, your hanging indent is now justified half an inch. And you can see down here in the text that this part that was highlighted is now a hanging indent. This is helpful for a table of contents or a works cited page on a paper, and you might have other uses as well. I hope this video was helpful in learning how to second line or hanging indent in Microsoft Word. If it was, please give it a thumbs up, share it with anyone else who might benefit from it, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with all of our tech tips. See you in the next video.